For ten months, almost nobody knew how Charlene Murphy had died. Murphy, 75, died at Vanderbilt University Medical Center in December of 2017 after a nurse accidentally gave her a fatal dose of the wrong drug. Murphy was supposed to receive a sedative, but was instead given Vecaronium, a paralyzer. It stopped her heart, leaving her brain dead. The nurse that allegedly made the error, Redonda Vaught, has been charged with reckless homicide. Vaught's court case has sparked a rallying cry for nurses who say they worry honest mistakes will be criminalized. And while Vaught faces potential jail time, Vanderbilt has largely avoided repercussions from the death. But a Tennessean review of federal and state records revealed that the hospital's response obscured the death from both the government and the general public. The hospital did not report the fatal medication error to the state, which is required by law. And two Vanderbilt doctors told the medical examiner that Murphy died a natural death from a brain bleed. Government regulators didn't discover the fatal error until they got an anonymous complaint 10 months later. Vanderbilt declined to comment. Hospital leaders previously admitted, We have come to appreciate our initial view of this event and our initial response was too limited. 